you doing, pal? Well, I'm trying to get a fire going. Uh, can I try? Uh, sure. Whoa! How'd you do that? Some of us are just cut out for jungle adventures and others. I'm Jay. And I'm Emma. Welcome to Press Play. Emma, you know what's really hard? What? Being a leader. Oh, yeah. I'm a volunteer trail guide, and from the moment I show up, they just laugh at me. Oh, well, maybe I can help. Let's work backwards. How do you end your sessions? I say, great session, everyone. If we keep it up, we'll be able to take on any trail and be triumphant. Then I end with a little prayer, thanking God for the beauty of creation and for keeping us safe. Wow, that's super good, Jay. How do you teach them? Well, we work on packing our packs, controlling our breathing, and of course, our end of the trail selfie poses. Well, that hits it all. So how do you begin your sessions? Well, I get my gear on and then I go ahead oh, and- Oh, your gear. Show me. Okay. Hmm. I'm suspect. Whew. Two bandanas? Well, I gotta look the part. Speaking of looking the part, the heroes in those adventure stories always look so cool. Yeah, with their leather jackets. And their cool safari hats. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Three, two, one, press play! Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Whoa where are we? In a jeep? Uh, in the dark? Driving out of control! Ah! Hit the brakes! Hit the brakes! Ah! Oh. 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 Now, question, does the jeep have lights? Maybe we could turn them on? Uh, good idea. Mm -hmm. Okay, they're on. Very scary, yes. Whoa, you can talk? I mean, you're in a wild jungle adventure. Anything is possible, really. So yeah, talking bad. <laughs> Sorry. It's all good. <laughs> you just get to know me. I'm actually a pretty charming fella. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> um. uh, Bartholomew. Uh, you can call me Bart. Bart the Bat! <laughs> it's fun, sort of, it, it brings... Yeah, good. um, Bart, um, where are we? And, no offense, um, why are we here with you? Oh, none taken! You're in the jungle, very far away from the trail you should be on! And I am Bart the Bat, here to lead you back! Oh, cool. Uh, uh, thanks, and how are you planning on doing that? I know, right? <laughs> Seems pretty crazy, huh? A talking bat leading you out of a dark jungle? I'll admit, I wasn't a born leader, <laughs> but I learned to lead. Hey, that reminds me of a Bible story from the book of Exodus, chapter 2. Oh. It's a story about a dude named Moses. Uh, he was born at a time in Egypt when Pharaoh had made this terrible command to kill all the Hebrew baby boys. So. Moses' mom tried to hide him. When she couldn't any longer, she put him in a basket and sailed him down the Nile River. Oh. Moses sailed right into the hands of Pharaoh's own daughter. Yes, believe it or not, but she loved Moses and wanted him to be her son. So she hired Moses' own mom to nurse him for her. Wow, <laughs> small world. God is so cool. I mean, babies in baskets? You two in the jungle with a talking bat? <laughs> no, no doubt. doubt. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, uh, Moses was raised as an Egyptian prince, uh, even though he was Hebrew. The Hebrew people were in slavery in Egypt and needed someone to lead them out. Moses didn't seem like the right guy, but God would teach him how to lead. Uh, one day Moses saw an Egyptian beating a fellow Hebrew, and in anger, he killed the Egyptian. <gasps> Whoa. Moses? Right? Uh, Moses tried to hide what he'd done, but he was found out. So he ran away. Again, 
not leadership material. <laughs> but uh, God would teach him. Uh, hold on, I need to stretch my wings. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. It's just the wings. Oh, no worries. <laughs> it was a little unexpected. <laughs> Speaking of unexpected, uh, how do you plan to lead us out of here? Well, I want to tell you, but dude's gonna scream. Jay? Okay, so I eat bugs. <laughs> my favorite are lightning bugs. And to make a long story short, my goop glows. And I made a goop path to guide you out. Kind of gross, but awesome, I see it. It reminds me of what happens next in my story. Oh, yeah. uh, uh, Moses stayed away for years and God's people stayed in slavery in Egypt. But then God showed up in the form of a burning bush in front of Moses. Oh, I get it. Glowing goop, burning bush, nice. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, God told Moses he was the guy to lead God's people out of Egypt. Moses couldn't believe it. What would he do? What would he say? In Exodus 3, 13 and 14, it says, Moses said to God, suppose I go to the Israelites and say to them, the God of your fathers has sent me to you. And they ask me, what is his name? Mm. Then what shall I tell them? Mm. God said to Moses, I am who I am. This is what you are to say to the Israelites. I am has sent me to you. This is just the beginning of how God would teach Moses how to lead. And the same, well, it, the same is true for all of us. God teaches us how to lead. Ooh. Well, looks like you let us back just in time. We have to go, Bart. Thank you so much. Uh, I don't do too well with goodbyes, so back to being Betty. <laughs> oh, wait, Bart, um, do you want to do the secret press play handshake with me? Really? Uh, you don't mind the wings? You don't think... You'll scream? No, he's cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jay, you okay? Great. Why? You know the whole bat screaming thing? Oh, psh. I'm totally over that. Oh, well, that's good because there's a bat right there. Ah! Just kidding, man. <laughs> We pressed play and ended up on a jungle adventure way off the path. We met our friend Bart the Bat, who not only led us back, but taught us all about how God taught Moses to lead, and how God will do the same for us. God teaches us how to lead. Jay, you good? Because it's time to... Drop, drop the, the verse! verse.